and Boomer Sooner, everybody. Thank you guys know me. I'm Harry James. In the next few minutes, we'll break down the first official conference game for Oklahoma this year and the first official conference game also for the Cincinnati Bearcats. The game will be played at Nippert Stadium in Cincinnati, Ohio with the uh, Bearcats. We'll give it a little preview coming up next. Right here, 1982 Bummer Sooner. Don't go away. Welcome back to the show, everybody. You guys know me. I'm Harry James. The Cincinnati Bearcats out of Cincinnati, Ohio. They play their home games at Nippert Stadium. Uh, Cincinnati is coming off of a 9-4 overall year, 6-2 in the American Conference, finishing second or and third in the conference with Central Florida. Of course, Central Florida went to the championship game last year with that as the second overall seed. They did do it to a bowl game where, non-surprisingly, or hilariously, I should say, they knocked off Louisville on the Cardinal 37-30 in the King of Keg Nails Fenway Bowl. So funny because... The coach of that Louisville team is the coach of of Cincinnati now, and that is Scott Satterfield coming in with his first season for Cincinnati. A 1995 graduate of Appalachian State coached at his alma mater when they were still FCS back in 2013. In the Southland Conference, Southern Conference, was Appalachian State. App State then took the upgrade to the Sunbelt Conference, where Scott Satterfield led them from 2014 to 2018 in FBS with the Sunbelt Conference, then took an even bigger rise in fame to ACC Country, where he was at Louisville. He was there at Louisville from 2019 to 2022, part of the ACC Conference, and is now part of the Cincinnati Bearcats, part of the Big 12 Conference. Helping him get the Big 12 to where Appalachian State is and where Louisville was uh, won't be easy, but it gets a lot easier with a transfer named Emory Jones. He wears number five for Cincinnati. He's a transfer from Arizona State. Where in 2022, Emory Jones passed for 1,533 yards on the ground uh, through the air, seven touchdowns, four in, uh, interceptions, and a long pass last year of 73 yards. That's Emory Jones, a transfer from Arizona State. No transfers here on the rushing attack. Uh, Corey Kiner, 81 total carries last year for Cincy. 
uh, for, to go with 392 yards on the ground, five touchdowns, and a long-distance run of 52 yards. Ryan Montgomery also returns to the Cincinnati Bearcat backfield. 63 total carries last year. Uh, 270 yards on the ground. Five tugboats and a long-distance run from 59 yards. Now, a new coach in Scott Satterfield, a new quarterback in um, Emory Jones. You know where I'm going with this. The receivers all new. They do include Aaron Turner. Turner, 57 total receptions last year to go with 527 yards through the air, three touchdowns, and a long-distance reception from 56 yards and is a transfer from Connecticut. Behind him on the receiving chart, Ethan Hall, wide receiver, 38 total tackle, uh, 38 total receptions last year to go for 410 yards through the air, two touchdowns, and a long distance shot from 78 yards out, and is a transfer from the Florida Gators. So that is all the offense. Defensively, they do have one returning starter from that nine and four. Uh, six and two American League team on defense. That's number ten, Brian Brian Throats or Threats. Fifty eight total reception. Uh, Fifty eight total tackles last year. Uh, zero forced fumbles. Zero fumbles recovered. Did have two picks in the game in the season, and is a safety. Next on the list is a, uh, another transfer. This one, Daniel. Uh, Grazik, 51 total tackles last year, two forced fumbles, a fumble recovered, zero picks. Defensive end slot, uh, Daniel is a transfer from Utah State. A little bit of offense, a little bit of defense. What about some special teams? Special teams, Fletcher Mason from special teams, on the punter at least, Fletcher Mason returns last year after averaging 63 total punts last year to average just about 46.2 yards on average, two touchbacks, 29 kick punts landed inside the 20-yard line, and a long-distance punt of 84 yards. Front punter, kicker, transfer from Arizona State's on this list. He comes over with Emory Jones. Does Carter Brown. Brown, last year at Arizona State, 11-14, and 78.6 yards in average, uh, percentage ranking, I should say, for field goals, and a long kick from 53 yards out. All right, guys. That will do it from the Cincinnati preview. Next week, a Big 12 team that we know pretty well around here, Iowa State. That game will be in Norman. We'll preview that game right here. Uh, 1982 Boomer Sooner. Till then, guys, click, like, subscribe, repost it, do whatever you want to on the, on the YouTube. 1982 Boomer Sooner. Also, Twitter, retweet, repost. It's up on there, too, at SoonerFan1982. And also... By the way, it's on my Facebook page, Harry James Taylor there on the Facebooks. All right, guys, thanks for watching, and boomer sooner, everybody. I'm out of here. Peace.